Hello everyone. This is Ms. Sharon working in VS Patel College of Arts and Science, Pilimora. Here I come with a presentation of English subject paper 13 for the students of class TYPA semester 5 and the title is To the Lighthouse. To the Lighthouse is written by Virginia Woolf. Let us see about the author. Adeline Virginia Woolf was an English writer, considered one of the most important modernist 20th century authors and also a pioneer in the use of stream of consciousness as a narrative device. She was best known for her novels, especially Mrs. Dalloway and To the Lighthouse. She also wrote pioneering essays on artistic theory, literary history, women's writing and the politics of power. To the Lighthouse is a novel which depicts the importance of relationships and the value that we serve to each other. The main characters of this novel are Mr. and Mrs. Ramsey and their eight children. James Ramsey, who is the youngest child. Lily Briscoe, who is an unmarried painter. Charles Tansley, who is not very well liked. William Banks, whom Mrs. Ramsey wants Lily to marry. Paul Raleigh and Minta Dowley, who became engaged during their visit. To the Lighthouse is divided into three sections. The first, the window, second, time passes, and the third, the lighthouse. Each section is fragmented into stream of consciousness contributions from various narrators. Mrs. Ramsey is considered as the most prominent and highlighting character in this novel. Mrs. Ramsey is a homely character who leads a perfect life as a human, as a wife, as a mother and also as a host to the friends at home. She holds a kind, understanding and loving nature with everyone. Mr. Ramsey is uncertain about the fate of his work and its legacy and his insecurity manifests itself either as a weapon or a weakness. Mr. Ramsey sees the world very differently from his wife. In the first section, the window, we see number of characters in a summer home in the Hubbards. Across the bay from their house stands a large lighthouse. Mr. Ramsey constantly disappoints his son James, who desperately wants to visit the lighthouse. Mrs. Ramsey maintains a comfortable atmosphere for all the members in home during the dinner time. Lily bristles at outspoken comments made by Charles Stansley, who suggests that women can neither paint nor write. Mr. Ramsey reacts rudely when Augustus Carmichael, a poet, asks for a second plate of soup. As the night draws on, however, these missteps write themselves and the guests come together to make a memorable evening. In second section, time passes segment, time passes more quickly. War breaks out across Europe. Mrs. Ramsey dies suddenly one night. Andrew Ramsey, her oldest son, is killed in battle and his sister Prue dies from an illness related to childbirth. The family no longer vacations at its summer home, which falls into a state of disrepair. Weeds take over the garden and spiders nest in the house. Ten years pass before the family returns. Mrs. Knapp, the housekeeper, employs a few other women to help set the house in order. They rescue the house from oblivion and decay and everything is in order when Lily Brisco returns. In the third section, the lighthouse, time returns to the slow detail of shifting points of view, similar in style to the window. Mr. Ramsey declares that he and James and Cam, one of his daughters, will journey to the lighthouse. 
on the morning of the voyage delays throw him into a fit of temper he appeals to lily for sympathy but unlike mrs ramsay she is unable to provide him with what he needs the ramsay set off and lily takes her place on the lawn determined to complete a painting she started but abandoned on her last visit James and Cam bristle at their father's blustery behavior and are embarrassed by his constant self-pity. Still, as the boat reaches its destination, the children feel a fondness for him. Even James, whose skill as a sailor, Mr. Ramsay praises, experiences a moment of connection with his father, though James so willfully resents him. across the bay lily puts the finishing touch on her painting she makes a definitive stroke on the canvas and puts her brush down finally having achieved her vision in the central section the lighthouse stands empty as the narrative marks the passage of time and the death of many of the characters in the third and final section with mrs ramsay dead the remaining family and friends finally get to the lighthouse and the novel becomes a meditation on love loss and creativity that's all for the presentation thanks for the watching